Hello, I'm Chris Robinson, application engineer at Lattice Semiconductor. Today I'm going to introduce the dual camera to HDMI demo, which uses our embedded vision development kit, which is comprised of three boards, the Crosslink input bridge board, the ECP5 processor board, and the HDMI output bridge board. This demo merges the images from two sensors and displays video output through HDMI. It can be used as a starting point for development of embedded vision applications, such as machine vision, robotic or stereo vision, security and surveillance, and automotive driver assistance. The Crosslink device is configured to be a 2 to 1 CSI2 sensor bridge, interfacing two Sony IMX214 sensors and providing RAW10 video to the ECP5. The LIF MD6000 has two hardened MIPI DFIs, which convert high speed MIPI data from the sensor to 8 bit parallel data. This data is passed through a FIFO to bring the image data from both sensors onto the same clock domain. Then a control capture block generates the sync signals and extracts video data along with other control parameters. The byte data is then converted into pixel data along with frame valid and line valid signals, as well as being transferred onto the pixel clock domain. Finally, the two camera images are merged together, combining half of the line from the first camera and half of the line from the second camera to create one complete line before sending to the ECP5. The ECP5 device provides basic image sensor processing. RAW10 video received from the Crosslink device is first sent through pixel correction, allowing dead or hot pixels to be corrected. Next, the video goes through white balancing, where the intensities of the primary colors are adjusted, rendering colors correctly. The debayer converts the RAW10 image data into an RGB image. Since each pixel of the sensor only represents a single color, the two missing colors need to be interpolated to get a proper color image. The color space converter is used to fine tune the color space, then gamma correction is applied to adjust for nonlinearity in the colors. After the video is processed, it is sent to the SII 1136, which takes the parallel video data and transmits 1080p60 to HDMI. For more information about the Embedded Vision Development Kit, please visit our website. Thank you for watching.